Hi, it's Sue from Stamping Stew in Connecticut.blogspot.com. Today I'm going to be showing you a pendulum card. It swings back and forth. You can push it or you can just tilt it and it will slide. The stamp set I'm using today is by Unity. All these great uh, fruits. I'll be using an embossing folder by Sizzix. Some colored pencils, some distress inks, a punch, and a regular, I believe this is a 1 16th punch. So let's get started. So what we're going to do today is first I'll give you a quick little tutorial how I colored the lemons. I just stamped out this image. I took some distress ink and I just pounced it in there to get some yellow, like so. Give it a little depth. This one is mustard seed. Just go on the, the edge of the sponge and I just put the darker color in. And this is just a freeform style of coloring, so it doesn't have to be perfect. If it goes out of the lines, that's fine. I got some fossilized oxide here. And again, just do the edge. Whoops. Like so, that's basically it. And then what I wanted to show you what you can do is you can mix mediums. So then I took some colored pencils and I just went over it just to give it a little depth. Some shadow over here, a little shadow over here, a little shadow here. You can take the, the yellow and just color all of, fill in all of it. And I know in the video it's hard to see, but in, in real life you can see all the detail. Take some white. Do some highlight. Normally I would take more time to do this, but I'm just showing you a, a quick little tutorial. So, so far. And then you can also just take and do a little watercoloring. So I have again a couple of oxide inks here. And then just color in the leaves. A little free form, freestyle watercolor. I'm mixing all kinds of things here. Like so. And then do the darker. Now this is going to come out real dark, so I'm going to do it over on the side just to get some of it off. Just add that. Like so. And then again, I took my pencils, but of course I didn't get any green pencils out, so this is my bag of all my colored pencils. So let's just grab a couple of green out of here and just do, just do some fast coloring here. So you can take and just fill it in with this light color. 
over the watercolor just to give it a little more depth. Take the dark one. Normally, too, I would let it dry a bit because I didn't use watercolor paper. But when this dries, it'll be fine. And then just blend it in. And you have the leaves. And then for the flowers, I just did white. Like so. And then I took my Wink of Stella and added some sparkle over the white pencil. And it gives it a lot of shine. I'm not sure if you can see it in here, but it does. So now we're going to assemble the card. So we need some pop dots. And so what I have here is, here's the base card. For now the, the inside is blank, but I will do that later. This is the embossed piece I did. Here's a finished colored one. And I just cut it down to approximately two and three quarters by three. And then the black piece is just slightly bigger. And that's going to be layered on there. But before we layer it, we need to take our punch. This is a, I think it's called a word window. But there's lots of punches out there with these slot type designs. And we're going to take, cut out a slot. We're going to use both of these pieces. Okay. So we're going to take, this is going to be our pendulum thing that slides back and forth. So what we need to do is get our 16th inch and we're just going to hold this on here like here, have about an inch, an inch and a quarter. We're going to punch a hole, oops, punch a hole in both of them. Take a little mini brad, slide that in, turn it over, and we're going to open the brad, but we don't want it completely flat. So if you take something like a poker, some kind of poker tool, put it under there, and then bend it down, it'll leave some give there. So then, it will move back and forth. So next what we're going to do is we're just going to put the pop dots on the back of the four corners. Take them off. Like so. And we're going to put that straight up and down. We're going to take our piece and we're just going to Add it on there. Okay, so now we have our lemons on our black card with the pendulum. Now for the pendulum, what we're going to do is we're going to take the small dots and we're going to put it right up at the tip. And we can't put two. There's our two little mini dots. Take the backings off. Okay, I'm going to take this off camera. There we go. And we got our dots there. And now 